just take a moment here and just say how much I love the music in this game. It's just, it's so good. I really, really like it. But guys, welcome back to more of Species. And for today, I want to... Well, okay, wait, hold on. That's a lot of extinct creatures. What the hell? What just happened? <laughs> oh, wow, okay. So I was gonna say, I was gonna say, you know, I had a bit of an idea for today. I wanted to try and, like, try and make something in particular, but... Uh, you know, in the process, I decided to go ahead and just, you know, change around a bunch of settings and really, you know, go a bit nuts on the whole, um, environment creation. And my god, I didn't even realise the sheer amount of creatures- Oh wow, look at all those! That one's got- That one's like a, a moose. A really weird looking moose. Oh wow, I didn't even realise all this. Oh my god, it's a kangaroo! <laughs> right, yeah. I want to actually try and make something here. I want to try and make something, but I, I may have just- discovered something entirely different so maybe i have to do that whole making something later my god there's so many look at this it's actually got like real eyes ash real my microphone's kind of in the wrong place i apologize but look at that that's actually so cool so okay it looks like we're about to have a mass extinction anyway or oh, oh my god that's 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 what's surviving right can we where's that coming out of its face right can we try and oh wait we have like is this an ice age? Do we have like a legit ice age just happened? Um, I didn't mean for that ha to happen. Let's go ahead then. Uh, let's just pause the game quickly. <laughs> Screw whatever idea I had in mind for today. Um, I want to try and fix this. Right. I've somehow managed like, I don't, don't really know what happened. Maybe, oh, I think I know what it is. Let's go ahead then. Could it go into wild options? Let me see. Let me see. There's, uh, oh, tree growth rates. Oh, interesting. Uh, forest density, yeah, I want that a lot higher. Like, I, w I want this to be, like, really fertile. That's what I was going for here. Um, I think I may have just, you know, completely screwed up the environment in general. And I think, uh, I think I know what I've done. I changed temperature variation really high. And I thought that meant, like, just the general landscape. Uh, but instead, an, a literal ice age has occurred. Like, I'm pretty sure the water's frozen there. At least, it, it looks it from a distance. Can I just say that the water there, like that entire little bit there, actually looks like spore. Like, same graphics. Oh yeah, it's like all steamy and frosty inside. Right, interesting. Um, well, whoops. Let's go ahead then, just bring a couple of creatures into the nursery then. We'll go ahead and crack on my original idea. I wanted to make a T-Rex, basically. I want to try and make a very own Tyrannosaurus Rex in this game, but first things first, is I need to bloody find a living creature. Let me see. Well, 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 I can do that. Let's go ahead and let's just, you know, really go a bit wild here with the, with uh, what we can do. I can make that one. I can revive it. Okay, let's just revive a bunch of these. We're avoiding the extinction right now. Right, so they're all been revived. Let's go ahead then. And that little corpse right there. Let's grab you. Okay, comes. You're in the way. Why is that weird flippy thingy? That's, that's his tail. I'm really liking like where these creatures are going. This is really cool. Right, so if I go ahead and just move all of you into the nursery. Yeah, this is actually so cool. They're actually, um, the creatures are getting more and more complex. Let's go ahead and move you away, sir. Let's move you over here. Let's move, we're going to try and rescue as many of these little things as we can. Literally playing God right now. This is brilliant. Let's go ahead and revive that one right there. Revive you and we'll move you over there. And let's go ahead and revive you. You're you're a different creature altogether. What? You're like a dog. Oh my god. Actually, so excited right now. It's like it's like actually a little dog. <laughs> I had no idea that was possible. Right. Okay. See, I've been doing like a couple more of these uh, little things here and there. I've been playing the game a little bit every now and then, and uh, mainly I've been doing those time lapses. Never have I seen creatures like this in a time lapse, and they're only recent as well. It's not like I've you know waited for like a major update or anything. I guess then so, just in, you know, the general time lapses and waiting for things to evolve in their own time is clearly extremely limited. I wasn't aware that they can actually have like legit, you know, ram horns as we saw earlier. Oh, there we go. Finally in the environment stage. Uh, let me let's just increase the fertility big time. Uh, the temperature probably isn't really going to help. Let's, I, actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a, control, a, a climate control device. So I want the temperature to be, the target temperature I want to be about 20. Oh. Whoops. About 20. Can I do that? There you go. And the fertility, yep, about 20 as well. Okay, let's just make sure that's properly entered. We'll do that there. Oh, that's got a different model. 
Oh, that actually looks quite different. So that all good? Yeah? Right then, let's see then what happens. So I need to- I just want to go ahead and just keep on healing these creatures. Oh, they probably want water and food, don't they? Yeah. Now we've got a bit of an issue here because I remember you guys telling me before. It's actually a little dog. It's dead though. I'm going to keep on resurrecting that little dog. Come back. Okay, it's too busy dying. Everything's dying. Mate, stop- get, get out of my way, you weird little spider. I don't even know what they are anymore. This, this isn't going anything like I planned. <laughs> I'm actually having a lot of fun figuring it out. So like I was saying a moment ago, I remember you guys actually telling me that um, if I keep on feeding them, they become dependent on being fed. So I want to avoid that. Fortunately, it looks like we finally got some plants growing. So that little uh, climate control device is actually really handy. That worked quickly. But again, that's just what we currently have. This very interesting spider looking fellow. Let's go ahead and edit it. Oh, look at it. It's actually like a weird tarantula thing. Alright then, so like I said, I want to try and make a T-Rex. I have a feeling this may take a while. <laughs> so uh, let me let me just... Oh, what's that button there? I'm not sure what that button is. Oh. Okay, that's interesting. Okay, so we'll make it green. So, you know, T-Rex is obviously green. Uh, we can make it luminescent. Oh, that's cool. But I'm not sure if I want to glow in the dark T-Rex. Actually, yeah, I do. I do want to glow in the dark T-Rex. That'd be really cool. Uh, saturation. Yeah, I don't really do anything. Secondary hue. We'll make that green as well. If it'll let me. Blue. There you go. Nice bright green. Skin type. Oh yes, scaly. Absolutely scaly. Uh, skin colour pattern. I just want it to be large and green, basically. Uh, oh, actually. I kind of like that one. It's a bit pale. Yeah. We have limb 01. Which limb is that? Oh, I see. Oh, wait. Oh, that's really cool. Okay, so can I make it uh, not feet? Can I make it uh, into like little hands? Or is hands not a supported feature? Well, it's not walking. So maybe it's not... Oh. <laughs> what the hell's that? <laughs> right. Can I make like little hands? Is that possible? Oh, what the Wait, what is that? Oh god, that is just so special. I have a feeling this is going to take a bit of a while... Uh, let me see. Yeah, I can't do anything about hands. Right, change your plans, guys. Change your plans. Um, <laughs> what even is that? I have a feeling if I want to do this properly, it's going to take a while. It's definitely going to take a while. So what I'm thinking is I'm going to leave the whole making a T-Rex thing. I will do that. Don't you worry. I 100% abs <laughs> will do that. But I, I think I'm gonna like proper try hard it. I'm gonna do that properly at some point. But for now, <laughs> I, I, did I miss something? I, I don't re remember half of these. This is brilliant. Like the customization is actually like going ham. I don't remember any of this. Let me see. Get have those big. There you go. That's close enough, right? Yeah. So what was that then? That's a limb, limb, a limb tip. Right, okay, I'm stupid. Sorry, guys. I, I'm i clearly just missing all sorts here. But this is why we're experimenting. It's why we're playing around with it. You know, we're learning. I'm learning anyway. And you're hopefully laughing at me. Oh, I can change the neck type. Oh, it has a neck. Yes, you have a neck. There you go. I can <laughs> have a really nice long neck. Make it really thick. I can make it slope. Oh, that's cool. So I'll go ahead then and make it... Uh, let me see. Okay, I can't highlight that's fine. If I make it like five. Oh, wow. No, make it 50. Oh, God. <laughs> nice. Nice. Oh, I can rotate it. Oh, that, that would have been better, wouldn't it? So, wait, hold on then. If I make that back to one and I rotate it upwards. Yeah, that looks better. That looks more aesthetically pleasing. Good, good. Head type. Oh, my God. What's up with those giant horns on its face? Like, I can't see anything. Like, is, are those horns? Let me see. Are they features? No, they're not. Okay. Let's check the face here. Whatever that is, I really just... I, I just don't like it. Go away, please. <laughs> Can I change the sides of it? Oh, yeah, there you go. Right, it's featured... Oh, my God, those eyes. It's horrifying. Oh, God, everything about you. You, you look... Oh, my God. That, that thing, guys. This thing. 
has seen some things. <laughs> Holy crap! <laughs> Can you imagine that as the thumbnail? In fact, I'm taking a screenshot of that. That's gonna be the thumbnail right there. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm loving it. I'm actually loving it so much. Like, of course, you know, the, the model's clearly unoptimized. It's clearly got a bit of a way to go. But there's there's a wonderful charm about just how... How... Like, I, I don't be insulting. I really, really don't be insulting. But it does look silly. It looks quite goofy. And... Oh my god, that one right there. There's definitely a massive charm to it. And I'm loving it. That, that's good, right? That, that little head there is good for a little sauropod face. In fact, if you just ignore whatever the hell the legs are doing, the entire upper half there is just like, that works, it's a nice sauropod. Uh, oh god, I, what the hell did I just hit? Um, I accidentally hit a button on my mouse, and now we're a goat. And I can't help but think that those giant horns there, they just they just look like hair. Oh wait, so hold on, there's 90 different heads. Oh my god, it's a horse. Holy crap. Oh, it's a crocodile. Yes. I At some point, I'm going to go over all those, I promise. But, oh my god, it's a crocodile. I Yes, I'm sold. It's actually like, super cool. Like, I've, either a lot has happened in, like, the last couple of days, or I'm just really thick and missed it all. Probably the latter, to be honest. I probably did just miss it all. But this is wicked. It's actually insane customising. Yeah, I think I, I, I'm surely just missed it all. No doubt. So we definitely could make it like, like a little puppy, like that random one that we saw. Right, so okay then. We've got like a really nice large tail there. We can change its curvature. Don't know how. I kind of missed the music. Can I have some music back, please? I really like the music. So we've got that funky tail thing. I like how it's wiggling around. Uh, brain. Oh, I'm not going to change the brain at all. If, I, if anything, I'm going to make, make you very... Um, uh, emphatic, and I'm gonna make you very motivated. Oh, look at that, guys! One fifty-seven. Not even intended. Number of features. Oh my god. Lots of features. If I give you like, yeah, there you go. Three of those. Okay, it doesn't like that apparently. There you go. We'll just have two for now then. Oh my god, those eyes. Yes, those eyes are just brilliant. And then <laughs> whiskers. Sure. What kind of... You really could make a lot of different creatures with this, couldn't you? Like, I've had you guys asking me to make, you know, like this and that. I've had uh, somebody ask me to make some realistic animals in this. Like, not literally realistic, but like, say, a, a, a real animal. And with seeing this now, I actually think that might be possible. Oh my god, look at... Oh, I love it. I, okay, let's just generate the... Oh my... Hi. There we go. So that is... Let me try that again. That is our chosen goal right there. So we're going to go from these freaky spider things to... I don't know why, I look at that and I feel like it's a Jeremy. We're going to go for Jeremy. Right then, let's go ahead and speed things up. Okay, I thought it was a math teacher then. It went down very quickly. Right then, guys. Let's see what happens. Oh my god, it looks like a monkey. Look at... That monkey man, that is that has seen some things. <gasps> what the hell? We we need to look at the why are they just running wait, delicious meat. Wait, what now? Uh, let's just yeah, select these things for a moment. Okay, never mind. Let's go into the clay diagram then. Oh wow, look at that. That's really cool. Oh my god, look at them. Isn't that just the most beautiful thing? oh hello. <laughs> hey, isn't that just the most beautiful thing you have ever seen? <laughs> That is making some amazing- Oh my god, look at it, it's so buff. And his shoulder is sticking through his chest. Oh god. That, that is actually really cool though. That, oh, what the hell? Look at his neck. Oh my god, look at his neck. So while that, uh, while they're off just, you know, evolving and such, just go ahead and check out some of the other animals that we, that we got from, uh, you know, just a random... <laughs> from the random evolution thing. See, see, look at that, guys. Look at that. A nice, thin, yet large physique. You can't get that in Spore. Like, already, you know, species owning Spore at this point. <laughs> like, I'd, I'd love to have that. Just just a large, flat surface. It'd, it'd make making fish so much easier. Why can't I... Oh, my God. Is it... Is its eyes inside its mouth? It's a giant potato. It's... 
It's like Pickle Rick went too far. Oh my god. What the hell? It's a, it's a giant, like, oh, there's so many words I want to say, but I've got to keep it PG. Oh, my God. It's a really demented pickle. Look at that. That pickle has seen some things. But that's pretty cool. It's like a really flat skunk beaver. Oh, yes, music. It's like a really flat skunk beaver kind of thing. What else do we have? Oh, my God. It's, it's an angry gecko lizard. <laughs> I'm pretty sure, right? They've took a lot of these characters here, like characters, um, a lot of these creatures. The way the game, you know, creates them. I'm pretty sure you can like make some legit characters out of these. Except for that one. No one do anything of that one, please. <laughs> Look at that fine majestic beast right there. Absolute unit. <laughs> Amazing. So uh, not to break immersion or anything, but every time it evolves, it appears to be thrusting. And uh, I'm, I'm not sure, I'm not, not sure how to feel about this. <laughs> oh my god, this 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 creature is just, it's so beautiful, guys. Just just look at that, An absolute work of art. So I just want to AFK for a moment, and I come back to find our lovely little friend doing push-ups. <laughs> or at least it looks like that every time his arms kind of change between evolutions. There, just you know, just. Casually doing push-ups? Yeah, that's, that's a good way to evolve. Defo. Oh my god, guys, look. It's like... It actually looks like a gecko plushie. Like, just the way that the legs are kind of angled off makes it look like it's just sitting... Like, um, sitting on its butt. It actually looks like a gecko plushie. That is amazing. Okay, now it looks like a potato. Oh, now it looks like a plushie again. Yay! <laughs> oh my god, what happened to my... What happened to my creature now? Oh god, the evolution is just going all over the place now. I, um, when I first looked at it, it just looked like a potato. There you go! What, the, what is that? It's, it's, it's devolving, apparently. What the? Oh my god. This weird potato gecko lizard thing. I'm having second thoughts about the thumbnail. Right then, guys, I've been doing this for about an hour now, and I really should stop and record something else. But as you can see, it is actually making some amazing progress, and it's almost... What's it doing now? Stop, stop retracting back into your potato shell. <laughs> but as you can see, it is actually getting really, really close to our end goal of uh, d uh, pfft, Jeremy the Lizard. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why it just looks like a Jeremy to me. But this is absolutely... Oh my god, that got a bit big. This is absolutely amazing. It really, really is, and I am definitely 100% going to spend some time, like, trying to make some proper creatures out of this. Like I said, Tyrannosaurus Rex can be, that's going to be, like, my main go-to. A couple of other ideas as well I've got in mind, that's a lot of you have been recommending and suggesting. Those will come. But guys, I am going to have to end it now. Oh god, just look at them all. Horrifying, but amazing, actually. Actually, before we leave... Oh my god, oh my god! Wow, wow, okay, it's still going. God damn! Let's just go ahead then, zoom all the way. Okay, that is as far out as we can. Jesus, look at that. Oh, oh, hi, didn't mean to click on that. Look at that! That is absolutely insane! That's created a bit of a bit of a thing in the top left corner there. Right, I um might need to report that. But god damn, that is that is awesome. But yeah, again guys, I've been recording for long enough now, I need to stop now. As always, thank you very much for watching. I hope you did enjoy it. If there's anything that you want me to check out in this game, please let me know. I'm really happy to just to check out as much as I can. Or if like, you've got anything in particular you want me to try out, I will do that. Let me know, guys. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Have fun, and I'll catch you later.